Hello, I'm Liviu Balan, and today I will show you how to create a virtual host listening on a custom port in Apache. So let's get started. First thing that uh, I will do is to go to the sites available directory. For this, I will use the cd command and uh, I will move to the directory ATC Apache 2 sites available. Hit the enter key and now if I type here ls minus l, you will see that here I am having several virtual host compile and from them I will use http.lipibalan.com.conf uh, configuration file. Uh, if you want to convince yourself that uh, the http.lipibalan.com uh, virtual host is up and running, uh, I will um, uh, open a web browser and here I will type http.livibalan.com. You will see that uh, a message is displayed here, hello, from uh, http.livibalan.com. The next thing that uh, I will do is to copy the content of uh, http.livibalan.com to another uh, file named http dot livibalan.com dash 8000.com hit the enter key and now I will have to type uh, the sudo password if I type ls minus l you will see that the new configuration file http dot livibalan.com dash 8000.com were created uh, the next, the next uh, thing that I will do is to edit the content of the file that I've just created using sudo vi and then the file name. Hit the enter key and on this configuration file uh, I will make some changes. First I will add a new um, uh, option, a new directive here, listen and then the port that uh, I want to listen to 8000. Uh, this is the IP address and ports that the server uh, listens to, the, di the listen directive. Next, the changes that I will do is to change uh, the AT port to 8000 port. So, uh, the AT is the default port for Apache. You will see here that I am not using any port and if I use the 80 port, I am redirected to uh, the URL without any port. But what I want to achieve during this tutorial is to uh, call the same URL but with a different port. The port that I will use during this tutorial is 8000. So I will put here listen uh, uh, to the listen uh, directive the 8000 port. And wherever I have uh, 80 port in this configuration file, I will change it to 8000. So I will move the virtual host directive. I will change the virtual host directive from 80 to 8000. Next, I will um, change uh, the location of the error log and custom log from 80 to 8000. Okay, and uh, because the content will be different for this virtual host, I will change also uh, the document root. So instead of var www.http.livibolan.com, I will use var w http.livibolan.com dash 8000. The same here for the direct directive I will use http.livibalan.com dash 8000 uh, this is a directory that uh, I will create next uh, okay let's uh, check again that everything is okay I will use slash and then I will type 80 uh, in order to check that I've replaced everywhere 80 with 8000. So listen to 8000, virtual host 8000, 
document root 8000, error log 8000, custom log 8000, directory 8000. Everything is okay. Right and quit. And now, uh, on the second tab on this uh, terminal, I will uh, move to var www. Hit the enter key. And as you can see here, I'm on the livio.polan user, which is able to uh, have uh, read and write access inside of the var www directory. Uh, type ls minus l. And what I want to achieve next is to copy the content of http.livyballon.com to http.livyballon.com dash 8000. In order, to, in order to do this, I will use the cp command with the dr option in order to copy the content recursively. And I will copy the content of uh, http.livyballon.com to http.livyballon.com dash 8000. Hit the enter key and now if I type ls minus l, you will see that uh, the content were copied. The next uh, thing that I will do is to go inside of http.livyballon.com-8000 and here if I type ls, you will see that uh, I have index.php. I will edit the content of index.php and instead of using http.livyballon.com, I will uh, use uh, hello from http.livyballon.com-8000. Uh, Right and quit. And another thing that I will have to do in order to apply the changes is to enable the uh, configuration file. For this, I will use sudo uh, a2n site and then http.livyballon.com-8000.conf. Hit the enter key and uh, as Apache told me, I will have to type service Apache to reload or restart in order to apply the changes. I will type sudo service Apache to restart in order to restart the Apache web server. Hit the enter key. And now, if I refresh the page again, you will see that nothing happened. But if I open the tab, a new tab, and uh, instead of using http.livyballon.com, I will uh, use http.livyballon.com uh, on port 8000, you will see that I'm getting the message hello from http.livyballon.com on port 8000. So, um, as you can see, I am able to access http.livyballon.com and also http.livyballon.com on another port than the default one, which is 80, and I am using the 8000 port. <coughs> so this is how you uh, create a virtual host, which listening on the 8000 port, a custom port uh, in Apache. If you want to learn more about Apache, about Ubuntu server, about web technologies, you can check out my uh, tutorials on YouTube and also visit my website livyballon.com. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.